I'm Drew Moyer, and this is a math project on collecting data and graphing. For all my younger students out there, this is a great way to practice collecting data and graphing it, and it's to ask 100 people what their favorite sport is. The first thing you want to do is start out with a chart, and in one column put the sport, and in the other put the number of votes that it got. So I asked about six sports. I asked about basketball, baseball, football, hockey, tennis, and other sports. And I tallied the number of votes that it got right here. And now, once you have the chart done, you're ready to actually translate that into a graph. So along the x-axis, I put the type of sport. And on the y-axis, I put the number of votes that that sport got. So for, right, uh, first up, we have basketball and it got 25 votes, so I wanna just draw a bar up right here between 20 and 30. And that is gonna be the bar for basketball. Same thing for baseball, I wanna look at 15 as the number of votes that it got, so I go over here to 15 and draw a bar up and down just like that. For football, we have 33 votes, so I'm gonna go just above 30 a little bit and draw my bar just like that. And then I have hockey, which got 13 votes, so I go over here just above 10. And now tennis got eight votes, so I go under 10 for this one. And other sports got six votes, so I go just about halfway between zero and 10 and draw it out just like that. So now you can see in graph form which sport was the most favorite and it looks like football was the most preferred by everyone that you polled. So I'm Drew Moyer and this is a math activity on collecting data and graphing. Mm -hmm.